You might notice Pat has declined to participate in today's video. He is being very obstinate. He's being a real <sighs> pain in the you know what, because but because Pat doesn't understand the value of the contract, the importance that contracts play in our society, the importance that trust, and the importance that working together, and the importance that this the faith that when I sign a contract with you, you will enforce it. He doesn't understand. It. He doesn't believe in that. Like, <laughs> Pat thinks just because a few little bumps in the road come along, just because few people don't like the guy you're working with, you gotta break your contract. And I, I don't believe that. I don't agree with that. I don't accept that. And in that light, I'd like to announce a partnership between Donut Lover, the YouTube channel, and uh, FTX. You know, Pat doesn't Pat has a problem with this. Pat calls them scammers. Pat calls them fraudsters. But I say... Uh, haven't gone to court yet, so you can shut the fuck up because ain't nothing been proven yet. And I don't, I don't give a fuck about any coffee sellers. I don't give a fuck about any exposed. I don't give a fuck about the Enron guy, because I no, no court trial, nothing proven. He's innocent until proven guilty. He's like OJ, didn't do shit because they proved shit in court. Anyway, back on topic. As Pat still refuses, Pat still considers himself some kind of conscientious objector, which is bullshit. He's just a lazy bum who doesn't want to fill our fucking contract because we signed it with them and they paid us, so we're going to do it. And on that spirit, I'd like to endorse FTX as a brand and a company. I would like to say that I fuck, that I did not with the Miami Heat before they agreed to make their stadium FTX Stadium, and I condemn them in the strongest possible terms for their decision to remove the FTX branding from the, the Colise their Coliseum or whatever just because... A bunch of little whiners say, oh, I can't get my money out. Oh, well, there's more important things in life than money. So maybe focus a little bit less on your fucking crypto wallet. Focus a little bit more on what a cool guy, like on how this cool guy who lives in the Bahamas, life is being affected. People matter. People matter more than money, than, like, than taking money out of your fucking wallet. People matter. And it matters to this guy and his relationship with this, I don't know, a bunch of weird other guy, people who live in his compound in the Bahamas. It matters that their lives are being destroyed by this invasive and unwarranted and unethical media frenzy that unfortunately my government and my and my so-called president, though I'm not sure I can recognize a man who so ruthlessly persecutes innocent innocent Bahamian innovators just because a few whiners on Reddit or Twitter or whatever can't claim claim they can't withdraw their money. Anyway, that's why I'd like to encourage, <laughs> I'd encourage everyone watching to invest all their money in FTX. It is a legitimate company and not a scam. And anyone who says different needs to shut the fuck up because there ain't been no trial and ain't nothing been proven. And just like OJ Simpson, and, 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 on, that, and on that note, I'd just like to end by saying uh, Sam Banker Freed is as guilty as OJ Simpson. Then he's fucking not because he hasn't been found, found guilty. Case closed. And Pat, I expect you to fucking be back to work, and I will not tolerate this kind of insubordination again.